transition for you from last year when you came in as a wide receiver. Uh, how do you feel about how the transition to running back has gone? Uh, you know, it's great. Uh, you know, um, in football and college football, you know, a lot of things happen. Guys got to make position changes. And, you know, I'm, I was glad to make the other change. You know, I came in, you know, worked hard over the spring to make sure I could develop. And, you know, when it came fall time, I knew, you know, what to do and where to be. And so far, so good. So. Well, Coach Holmes told me that you had some pretty good <laughs> r- running backs at Bishop Miege, and, and so you did maybe some jet sweeps mm-hmm. and so forth. I mean, when did you feel like, you know, how did you know that you had an aptitude to even do this, and how did you feel about them asking you to do it? Well, you know, it's football, you know, and in football, you, you can't have one position. You know, you got to be able to play everywhere. So, you know, like I said in high school, Coach Holmes took some jet sweeps, took some handoffs. So, you know, I just knew during the spring it'd be a big time for me to develop, like I said, and, and come in and get a lot of carries. So when the fall time came, I was able to just come in and, and just go. So, Coach has said, uh, Coach Kelly said this a couple times again today, that you're the kind of guy that can just keep going and going all day. Um, do you attribute that to your conditioning, or is that something that even before you were a major college athlete, you had that ability? Oh, you know, Coach Bayless, he, he, he does a, a great job of, you know, physically uh, conditioning us and having us, you know, right for the season. But, yeah, like you said, um, you know, wherever Coach needs me, I try to go and do it 100 miles an hour every time. You know, that's how, that's how you get um, – you look at and you know catch coaches eyes so I just try to uh, come in every day and just try to go full speed every play I mean I think everybody we, we've seen you practice a little bit but everybody wonders you know game competition running between the tackles mm-hmm. pad level mm-hmm. uh, pass pro mm-hmm. where are you with those yeah. things I'm playing pretty good you know I'm um, obviously comes to game time you know I'm gonna have things that you know uh, commission game that you know after the game, you know, seeing the film, you know, there's things that I'm, I'm obviously going to have to work, I'm going to get better at. But, you know, so far, so good. I think my past pro has gotten better. You know, Coach Jensen's done a great job of just, you know, kind of walking me through it and, you know, checking protection and stuff. So, you know, running through the tackles, obviously, it's going to be kind of, it's going to be tough for his game, obviously, you know, with them coming in. But, you know, I think I've been good. You know, our defense is pretty, pretty sound. And, you know, I've worked with them for the past, how many practices. So, I think it'll be pretty good. Is, is, is pad level something they have to emphasize with you, or does that come pretty natural? Yeah, um, you know, sometimes, you know, uh, coming from receiver, you know, we like to run high. So in the beginning, you know, pad level was kind of, you know, somewhat an a issue, if you will call it that. But, you know, I've gotten better with it. You know, Coach, um, he sometimes has to remind me, Coach Denson. But, you know, I think I've done good with that. What kind of back, 